more viewers. Logical, that's very good. Nice work, Harsh. We're dealing with a organization of the passage or the logic of the passage. The organization of the passage can best be described by which of the following. So let's go ahead. We worked it enough, we can go and reference it when we need to. A thesis is stated, an example is cited in support of this thesis, a counterexample is cited and then rebuted, and hold on to that. A researcher's methodologies are explored, statistics are debunked, and then a counterclaim is established. I'm going to hold on to that too. A problem is examined. Two possible solutions. Uh, this part doesn't happen. They don't talk about problems and providing two solutions. I'm just going to get rid of that. A possible explanation for a problem is presented. The explanation is debunked with examples and statistics, and an opposing explanation is presented. So they present a possible explanation, and then he debunks it. He uses statistics and examples, example, statistics, and an opposing explanation is presented. Yes, he goes on to explain his opposing presentation. I'm going to hold on to that too. A claim is made about a problem, examples of the problem are given, and then a solution is discussed and ultimately advocated. This doesn't go on. So what did we have? We left ourselves with um, we, left, we got rid of E, we got rid of C, we left ourselves with A, B, and D, and we kind of found the pieces of D, but let's go back to these. So this is the organization of the passage, it should come as the passage is, uh, comes to us, so the first, we don't get a researcher's methodologies explored to start, we first see this happen. And that works better with this piece here. So I'm going to get rid of B. How about A? A thesis is stated. An example. Okay, so you know the sort of one angle is stated. Okay, an example is cited in support of the thesis. This doesn't happen. That doesn't happen. So I can get rid of that. Great. So let's go ahead and just take a quick review here. We looked at infer imply questions. We looked at explicitly stated questions and we saw a logical structure question. Your homework for Brockett standard members is five complete reading comprehension passage. Make sure to do them. Make sure to review them. You're going to get all sorts of questions. Apply the techniques that we've learned so far on the questions that you can identify as the ones we've seen. For questions that aren't like the ones we've seen yet, just work them as you've been working them and we'll get our process down for those as well.